The enemy wants to keep us in a place where we isolate, where we cut people off. We don't talk because it's heavy. It's something that I'm gonna have to be vulnerable. What are they gonna think of me? It'd just be better if I kept it to myself. But the crazy thing is, that the enemy will try and trick us and deceive us that the very thing that God wants to try and the enemy will try and trick us and make us think it's something completely different but but what God is wanting to do is he's wanting to consecrate us prepare the way prepare the way of the Lord prepare the way prepare the way of the Lord prepare the Cases, back on the vlog. What's up, boy? Got a thesis. My God never lost you, remain undefeated. Staring danger in the face and I'm cheesing. I want the ice to the point that I'm freezing. Y'all know I got my boys here. You got Enzo. Z, them kick legs, boy. Yo. We finna go crazy, you know, we finna turn up, boy. Man. We finna have a fun time with my boys. We finna about Jesus, man. We finna, you know, praise the Lord, but we finna get right for real. We finna take every dub, experience church, fam. Come on now. Yeah. Yes, sir. Look at him. We produce athletes, bro. Come on, man. We produce athletes. Yes, sir. by the name of God. you could deliver me from all these that got me yeah, man, we here. Miami's Berg, Ohio, man. Got a camera going on. Almost got hit with a football. But yeah, man, we've been get out here like Zeke said, but we can have a great time. We can take these kids closer to Christ, even for ourselves. We can help serve. You know what I'm saying? If you ever get an opportunity, y'all, man, make sure you go help out and serve in the community, man. It's the best thing you can do. You feel me? So, yeah. So, I'm going to show y'all what's going on. I'm tired right now. I'm long ass bus ride, but we go. I'm for sure going to get some good content for y'all today, so tune in, enjoy the vlog, and let's get right on game. Can't be a Ooh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna do it. You wanna do that? Yo, ain't no way. You ready? You look you look good though, brother. I put your lanyard in the back. What you about to do? I was ready for this. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Zo! <laughs> yeah! 
Man, it's early in the morning, dog. It's camp leader type thing. Got Zeke over here. Feel me? We finna get ready for him. We play these games with these kids. We got service before that, though. Yeah. So I'm gonna have a little fun thing for y'all tonight, man. Right now, we just getting the work in, but later on, I'm gonna show y'all what we got going on. So, we got these shirts right here, they're pretty dope. See? So stay tuned, y'all. I'm got y'all, man. She's gonna be hard. No cap, no kissy for real. What the says, guys. So, don't set an example, don't be fighting with the rap. If you don't agree with them. <laughs> Hey, 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 hey. Boy, Josh. Go crazy, Josh. Good defense. Hit it back. Protect the goal. Protect the goal. Good kick. I saw that. Protect it. Hit it. Hit it. Yeah. Good hit. Let's go, Josh. Let's go, Connor. Come on. I see you, Connor. Whoa. Oh. Oh, good defense. Good defense. <laughs> It's the most difficult game I've ever played. Oh, that's blue on this side? That's blue Wait, wait, that was fine. That was good. No, no, no. We have it. We have it started. My boy Connor. Josh. Risk my team down there. Let's go! Man, I ain't never seen this before. Telling the people about the trip, how it's been so far? Uh, it's been dope. Great opportunity to just, you know, just fulfill like, you know, dreams that we've had in the past. So, yeah, what's up? How are you? How are you, Charlie? Nah, trip's been great. I think the best part of it is uh, knowing like we're doing the right thing but still having fun. And like, he's showing people like just being on this path, like chasing Christ, this is the type of opportunities you can get. And like, it's not really lame, like how people think it is. Or it's like, just like you said in the message, you know, you, you just gotta, you know, we, there's stuff that, you know, we, God puts in our puts puts that put like he puts that in our like on our lives, you know. You guys don't care if we sit here, do you? Oh no, it's not. Yeah, you you're fine. Cheeks are in. I'm uh, chilling. On a vlog, dude. You want to say hey? What's the four? I got a YouTube channel. channel. I trade for Ali. <laughs> 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 What's your name on YouTube? It calls me J Red. Okay. So that's my name. So oh, if you type in J Red with football at the end. J Red? Yeah. Okay. And I play college football, both of us do. Really? Yeah, oh, I very play cool. Defiance in Defiance, Ohio. Okay. Yeah. So that's 
so. Uh, we'll look you up. Yeah, for Very sure. Cool. Yeah. Because on there, I'm just trying to encourage a lot of you to show them the right way. Like, you can have fun while pursuing your purpose. So I'm just trying to change lives. You need that. We need that. Right. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Good for you then. Thank That's you so hard much. to do. Yeah, it really is. It's hard to step out and still hope that you have people that want to be around. Exactly. So, good for you. Yes, ma'am. Right. That's one of like the biggest things that we just want to fulfill. Yeah. Like that's a dream. So like just going out there and just giving back. Eliana? My, for me, it's more of like giving back to community. Yeah. Me, more focused on like you. So like, I mean, with helping with you and stuff, I'm, I've been. It's been a great opportunity. God will like, take you guys man, far. Yeah. It's been dope. You'll go far. That's awesome. It's amazing. I've been noticing more athletes are coming out and saying, like, speaking out, you know? Yeah. So, wonderful. Yeah, I finally got some time to relax, y'all. Like I was saying while we was talking, the uh, thing was, I'm trying to tell y'all, like, don't be afraid to get connected with people. Or don't be too good to go to church. Don't be too lazy to go to church. Don't be too, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't be too caught up in your problems and avoid like church because you just never know what opportunities can lead to. I want my balls in this. <laughs> Man, shut <laughs> show. <laughs> it ain't funny. But not for real, man. Like, all right, so tell me this, Z. When, like, when you was younger, would you ever have seen yourself like in this position right now? In or, the position like this right now? No. Mm -hmm. Did have did I have I ever dreamed of like working with youth? Of course, but it was mm -hmm. never. I was always been, always been on like worship ministry, not like young adults ministry. So mm -hmm. you know, this is a lot new stuff, but it's God, you know, putting new things in your way to yeah. learn to expand your your faith. And boy, it's it's been a cool like experience you know son mm -hmm. man this this is a blessing bro not everybody gets this opportunity but the fact that two dudes you know from you know, from two big from two cities you know a bunch of violence and stuff man and exactly playing college ball now working with man it's, it's honestly it's been a huge blessing bro <laughs> ain't it crazy bro man it's crazy that's what i'm saying that's what i'm trying to tell them yep I'm telling, I'm trying to tell them like, don't be afraid to do it. You know Man, what I'm saying? Bro, never be afraid to just either just, you know, show people what, what you know, like. This, don't, you know? don't be too cool to not like try, like you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. A lot of people worry about what their friends go say and stuff like that. Nah, fam. You know, I feel like at the end of the day, you build more, you build better friends that'll support you in exactly. something. Like, bro, I've come across many people this past past day or so man so many great people mm -hmm. it's like people who are in college you know like us bro but they go to bible school bro you know they go to right. Bible college but they don't oh, that's that's cold that's cold like you know like people you know, haven't even heard of bible college before yeah like that's something i would love to do one day go to college you know just just to like learn how to like actually like read a bible and like, you know, learn ministry like, oh yeah for man, sure dude. that's so cool so, so yeah in a cool day though, man. So if y'all don't believe me, believe my boy Zeke. Y'all know y'all know who Zeke is. And Best he, kicker in the conference, you know. That's who I am. That's for sure. That's the inspiration the part. Later tonight, I'm gonna have some fun stuff for y'all to see. So yeah. Check back again with y'all in a little minute.
don't possess it, but we profess it. Ooh, I'm a Christian. Ooh, bless and highly favored, brother. It's the language that we all speak. But I don't want to talk to the professing Christians. I want to talk to the possessing ones. Ones that really possess it because if I squeeze an orange and grape juice came out, would that be weird? Would it be weird? Would it be weird? Okay. But if I squeeze the Christian and Jesus doesn't come out, shouldn't that be weird? So what's, what comes out of you when you're squeezed? Most people murmur and complain, which is actually a demonic tongue when we begin to murmur and complain about the things that we're going through. Six years, okay, cool, but what have you lived? I don't care how many scriptures you know about, I care about the scriptures you live. Like we're called to be walking love, we're called to shine bright in the darkness. And so as God began to tell me who I was, I realized that God wanted to do something profound in my life. What's unfortunate is culture teaches us that doing the right thing, if it costs me something, it's not worth doing. It shows me that culture teaches us that if I do the if I do the wrong thing, but I admit to it, it's not a good thing to do. All right, ladies, lean back real quick, fellas, lean with me real quick, fellas, lean with me. Now I'm gonna help y'all out because you guys are the only generation that I've ever seen. Yes, I'm getting down. Y'all, the only generation that I have ever seen that you will see a lady in person, you'll like her picture, you'll unlike her picture, you'll like it again just because you want her to know, hey girl, listen, I just want you to know I noticed you. <laughs> then you'll see her in person, you'll see her at youth group, you'll see her at camp, and you won't say a word. I don't understand this phenomenon of the next generation. So fellas, I want y'all to repeat after you, fellas. Repeat after you, fellas, say, it's okay. It's okay. Uh-uh, fellas, I need y'all to say it like you mean to say, it's okay. It's okay. To say. To say. Hey. Hey. All right. <laughs> now, I'm going to slide into DM. Don't judge me. I was training for the NFL in Texas. Stop it. And so the only way I could talk to her was through Facebook. So I slid her DM because she broke up with some dude, but here's what I did. Fellas, listen, take notes. Instead of... Me just coming out of side was just, hey girl, I just want you to know. I just want you to know. I'm praying for you. Now, fellas, repeat after me. Say, if you pray, if you pray, she will stay. She will stay. Say, if you pray, if you pray, she will stay. She will stay a whole bunch of scriptures because it's important. Listen, if we don't have the word on the inside of us, how can I ever fight against the devil? When Jesus was tempted by Satan, he fought him back with the word. And God began to wash with the word and the word became a part of who I was and it became the language that I spoke. I don't murmur and complain anymore. Yes, I have bad moments, but I'll let my bad moments turn into bad days. Yes, I struggle with anxiety, but I found Philippians 4, 6. It says, be anxious for nothing, but every day in prayer and supplication. Put things in and make your request known to God. When you're struggling with anxiety, the word of God has the answer. But the anointing of God, the Holy Spirit that he empowers us to do for him. But listen, I'm here, I, I feel this in my spirit. Like there are some people that are like, all right, Marcus, like I want to do for God, but I don't know who I am in him. Well, this is your chance. <laughs> so we did a we did a youth event at our church and it was all it was all the glow
Don't finish the free throw line. Yo. <laughs> Yo, I hope y'all enjoyed that video, man. I really appreciate y'all for tuning in. Man, I put a lot of time and effort into these videos. Um, I hope y'all gained something from it. I hope y'all were inspired by what was just going on, man. It's a different feeling, bro, when you... Sorry about my hair, y'all. My hair wet. I just washed it. But, um, nah, for real, it's a different feeling, man, when you see a whole bunch of kids, you know, and you hear out their stories, you hear out the things they've been through and their testimonies and the, just the hardships they face in life. And, um, despite that, yet they still, like, mature enough to know, like, God is the way that's going to help you overcome every situation and everything you go through is just a battle it's a test it's not to bring you down it's not to hurt you it's just there for you to grow so yeah man and i just want to thank y'all for watching man i want to thank y'all for just supporting you know what i'm saying thank y'all for just bringing up my youtube channel man i might not say it in person but that really means more to me than anything because I'm just like y'all, bro. I ain't no famous, no most popping dude or whatever, you know what I'm saying? And that's not what I'm chasing, but I'm just like y'all, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm just a young kid, young man with a dream, bro. Just like y'all, you feel me? And what I'm, we in this together, so what I'm just trying to show y'all is like, just do it, bro. It's possible, just do it, man. That's all we got to do. And uh, last few things I want to say, I want to, because I know some of the youth, they go watch this. I wanna say I thank y'all more than anything. Like, I appreciate y'all down deep into my heart, man. Like, y'all keep me more motivated than anything. Y'all almost keep me as much motivated than my family does. Like, y'all are like my inspiration. Y'all keep me going, bro. And I just want to do so much for y'all. That's kind of, why well, I'm pushing myself so hard when it comes to football, this education and whatever, man. Y'all just don't understand. I really want to do so much with y'all. I want to keep, you know what I'm saying, motivating y'all. And I want to see y'all grow. And I want to see y'all chase y'all long dreams, man. So thank y'all. Y'all know what I'm saying. We're going to always turn up when we see each other. we always going to have a good time. we always going to laugh. But I want to tell y'all, I want to thank y'all so much for just being y'all selves and not letting others affect who you are and you still chasing Christ, man. Keep doing that. Don't never stop doing that. I'm telling y'all, that's how I'm in the position I'm in today. And I'm going to keep going up no matter what. I got the drip going on and I got the drip going on. You feel me? <laughs> and then shout out to my guys, man. Shout out to my guys. Um, Y'all know who y'all is. Man, y'all y'all really like show me what a true brother is because that's something I've been just not having for so long, for so many years, especially up here in college, like, I ain't understand, like, what a real homie was, and y'all showing me that, and we just like-minded people, you know what I'm saying, and we done had so many conversations about elevating, about Christ, about business, you know what I'm saying, wanting to do our own thing, and I can't wait to see what y'all do, and we gonna get this together, man, so y'all stay tuned, but we got a lot coming up, and we gonna make it happen, and we gonna put it in motion. And trust me, it's going to happen, y'all. Y'all believe me when I say this, it's going to happen. For real. So that's it, y'all. I appreciate y'all for watching again, man. Hope y'all enjoyed. Share this video as much as y'all can. Get to know, and share get to know YouTube, Jesus. Get in more on the way. Season coming up. More than a you know on the weekend. Up, need to supply my faith so calling get it. Never be tweaking. Give ain't got faith, I know you get the freaking. Y'all give me strength, cause right now I'm just decent. Give you it all so my faith will start.